citrulline, electron transport chain, human enzymes catalyze thousands of vital reactions. These proteins often need a cofactor for their actions. Vitamin K redox cycling allows gamma carboxylation. Pyridoxal phosphate is essential for transamination. Cobalamin is requisite for homocysteine methylation in addition to methylmalonyl thioester isomerization. Biotin is a coenzyme for numerous carboxylases with exception for the carbamoyl phosphate synthetases. Type 1 consumes ammonium in the first step of the urea cycle. Type 2 makes precursors of pyrimidine heterocycle. Cyp450 isozymes and glutathione reductase cannot use NADH but rather NADPH. That's facts. Yeah, we rep the transferases and show love to hydrolases, even oxidoreductases, mutases, synthases, and ligases, mutases, synthases, but no liases. Yeah, we only form bonds, we ain't never want no lice, now we ain't never want no lice. Even translocate ions, but we ain't never want no lice, now we ain't never want no lice. Transfunctional groups, still I never want no lice, now we ain't never want no lice. That's the thing we don't do, yeah, we did that functionality for decarboxylase enzymes. Hold up, glucose is synthesized through glucose. Gluconeogenesis. Fatty acids are freed from triglycerides and lipolysis. Beta hydroxybutyrate is produced by ketogenesis. Hexoses are catabolized anaerobically by glycolysis. Glucokinase accommodates higher glucose concentrations, even postprandially, it rarely reaches saturation. In contrast, hexokinase has a low capacity. Nonetheless, it binds its substrates with a high affinity. Hexokinase yields hexo-6-phosphates irreversibly. It can utilize fructose too, but consumes glucose typically. Fructokinase generates fructose 1-phosphate selectively, and this phosphoketohexose is a substrate for aldolase BS lord. Yeah, we rep the transferases and show love to hydrolases, even oxidoreductases, mutases, synthases, and ligases, mutases, synthases, but no liases. Yeah, we only form bonds, we ain't never want no lice, now we ain't never want no lice. Even translocate ions, but we ain't never want no lice, now we ain't never want no lice. Transfunctional groups, still I never want no lice, now we ain't never want no lice. That's the thing we don't do, yeah, we leave that functionality for decarboxylase enzymes, hold on. Oxoglutarate and pyruvate dehydrate. Androgenases use thiamine. Heptahelical receptors are coupled to the G protein. The alpha subunits are a class of signaling GTPase. The subunit GQ alpha triggers a phospholipase. This yields a second messenger diacylglycerol, in addition to 1,4,5 triphosphomyoinositol, initiating calcium and flux through IP3 receptors, which in turn will activate the protein kinase C effector. Oh. Yeah, we rep the transferases and show love to hydrolases, even oxidoreductases, mutases, synthases, and ligases, mutases, synthases, but no liases. Yeah, we only form bonds, we ain't never want no lice, now we ain't never want no lice. Even translocate ions, but we ain't never want no lice, now we ain't never want no lice. Transfunctional groups, still I never want no lice, now we ain't never want no lice. That's the thing we don't do, yeah, we leave that functionality for decarboxylase enzymes, hold up. Intracellular calcium is Sensed by calmodulin. Anterograde transport is done via kinesin. Glycoprotein 2B3A binds fibrinogen. Right handed DNA, left handed procollagen. <laughs> okay, I'm done.